On November 11, 2024, China unveiled the Falcon 70, a cutting-edge, short- and medium-range air defense system at the Zhuhai Air Show. Developed by the Shanghai Academy of Space Technology, part of the China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation, the Falcon 70 introduces an advanced approach to counter increasingly sophisticated aerial threats, particularly in addressing the source of unmanned aerial vehicle squirm attacks. With its autonomous operational capability, multi-target engagement, and modular design, the Falcon 70 is positioned to enhance both China's domestic air defense and its export market footprint. The Falcon 70 was designed with lessons learned from modern conflicts and limitations observed in China's previous systems, such as the HQ-16 and HQ-7B. One of the most significant improvements lies in its high missile capacity. Each vehicle can carry 21 missiles, vastly surpassing the engagement capabilities of earlier Chinese systems and even leading international systems like Russia's Tor M2 and Berg M2 and Israel's Spider. In a battalion formation, the Falcon 70 can deploy over a hundred missiles, providing formidable resistance to saturation attacks. This capacity is a direct response to challenges posed by the increasing use of UAV squirms, which have taxed the defensive capabilities of systems like Russia's Panzer S-1 in Syria and Ukraine. The Falcon 70 integrates soft and hard cure methods to counter UAVs and loitering munitions, which have become prevalent threats on modern battlefields. For electronic warfare, the system is equipped with electronic countermeasures that can disrupt GPS signals and communication links, impairing squirm coordination and effectively neutralizing or dispersing drone attacks. In addition, the system includes two specialized missiles, the LY-70 medium-range missile. Using composite guidance, the LY-70 provides robust targeting against various aerial threats, including UAVs and cruise missiles, within a range of up to 70 km. The FB-10A short-range missile, equipped with infrared emission guidance, the FB-10A is designed for close-range engagements up to 18 km, offering high anti-jamming performance and multi-target capability. These missiles, coupled with the Falcon 70's face array radar and electro-optical tracking, enable it to detect, track, and engage targets independently. The phase array radar allows for 360-degree tracking in real time, while the electro-optical system enhances tracking in situations where radar might be compromised or limited, such as in dense urban or electronically congested environments. With a substantial missile capacity, modular design, and adaptability for autonomous operations, the Falcon 70 is versatile enough to pull from a range of roles from field and point defense to convoy protection and critical infrastructure defense. The system's strategies, currently based on a Volvo 6x2 configuration, could be adapted to tracked or armor platforms further enhancing its deployability for diverse operational needs across China's military branches. While the Falcon 70 is primarily targeted at the export market, its capabilities make it a valuable addition to China's own air defense architecture. China's current short and medium-range air defenses 
rely on systems like the HQ-16, which covers larger operational zones, and the HQ-17, designed for battlefield proximity defense. The Falcon 70 effectively bridges the range gap between these systems, providing coverage from 15 to 70 kilometers and enabling a more seamless layer defense strategy. Its compact, high mobility design also complements longer range systems like the HQ 9B and the newly introduced HQ 19, enhancing China's multi tie air defense network. Although the Falcon 70 has only recently been introduced, its potential for export and deployment is already significant. Countries in regions with escalating UAV and missile threats, such as the Middle East, South Asia, and Eastern Europe, are likely target markets for the system. Given the increasing global demand for air defense systems, capable of countering squirm drones and other complex area threats, the Falcon 70 could appear to militaries seeking an advanced autonomous air defense solution with high missile capacity. As demonstrated by the competitive engagement capabilities of systems like the Tor M2 and Spider, there is a clear need for robust, medium and short-range solutions capable of handling high-density attacks. The Falcon 70, with its large missile loadout and electronic countermeasures, offers a unique blend of firepower, versatility and technological sophistication that could make it a formidable option for countries facing similar tactical challenges. China's multi-layer defense capabilities received a notable boost with the introduction of the Falcon 70, SWS-2 and HQ-19 systems at the Chuhai Air Show. The Falcon 70's focus on countering UAVs, cruise missiles and squirm tactics aligns with China's broader strategy of integrated air defense, providing critical support to long-range interceptors like the HQ-19, which targets medium-range ballistic missiles, and the SWS-2, which combines missiles with a 35mm cannon for close-range defense. The Falcon 70's combination of autonomous capabilities, high missile capacity, and adaptability to evolving air assault methods reflects an advanced approach to contemporary air defense. With a high probability of interception against a broad spectrum of threats, the Falcon 70 is poised to enhance not only China's defensive infrastructure, but also its reputation as a key player in the global air defense market.